Hello, hello. How are you today? Good to see you one more time. Hello, Alicia Davis. Hello, hello. teacher. Hello. You were absent yesterday. Uh, <laughs> yes. yes. A lot, a lot of yes. work. Yesterday was very long day. Oh. I went to bed at uh, the 3 a.m. So today? Yes. Wow. Long day. Well, <laughs> anyway, all right. That's life. <laughs> it's not fair. Me gusta, it's not fair, but anyway. <laughs> I guess I can ask ojeras. <laughs> Don't worry, Hello. you look good. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. All right. So, okay, we still have one more minute to go. Okay, waiting for the others. Yesterday, uh, did you watch the video? Viste el video para más o menos que lo que hicimos? No. Okay, I remember. I finished um, fine. PM, o sea, en la tarde. Okay. Sin que terminé y solo me fue a acostar un rato y... Ajá. Uh -huh. <laughs> Take a Pero shower. el fin de semana me voy a poner. Sí, okay. exacto. <laughs> don't worry. Today we're going to do a review. All right, so you don't get lost. Okay? Okay. All right. Hello, Billy, Billy. Hello. <laughs> so happy to see you guys. All right, so happy to see you. Just let me check here. Um, so let's, uh, okay, this one. I'm going to put here. Just let me send a test to the group. Yes. Okay, here we go. Let's start this. Okay, welcome one more. Hey, Adrian, hello. <laughs> hello. Okay, let me share my screen with you one more time. Uh, this is what we're gonna do. Just let me <clears throat> get the correct screen. Okay, perfect. Let me show you, okay, the agenda. This is the agenda. I'm gonna put it bigger. Okay. That's the agenda. We have five different activities, okay, as usual. And let's start, okay? Number one, Alicia. Tell me the first activity. Read it, please. Warm up. Alicia? Hello? Read the first activity. Lee la primera actividad. Read the first oh. activity. Warm up, review. Warm up, warm up. Warm up. Perfect. Review, Reviewing. Reviewing previous class, how much? Yes, using how much. Thank you. Much? Number two, Billy. Asking. Asking. Asking question using how many? Thank you. All right. Activity number three, Adrián. Asking. Asking question about like and dislike. Perfect, all right. And hello, activity number four. Creating negative sentences using the simple present introduction. Introduction, hoy lo vamos a presentar. Introduction, that's good. And Elizabeth, activity uh, number five, please. Wrap up. Perfect. Thank you, Elizabeth. Wrap up. All right, guys, let's start with the class. The objective is this. Claudia, Xiomara, read the objective, please. To ask questions using how much and how many review. Review. Okay. Repaso. Review. Here we go. Number one, activity number one, using how much. Okay. So yesterday we started out, okay, using these expressions, food expressions, and today we're gonna continue. So yesterday we saw the first 
nine. We're going to continue with the other nine, okay, from 10 to 18. That's what we're going to do. But first, the way we did yesterday, pronunciation first. So here we go. So let's see if you remember the pronunciation from yesterday's class. Rubidia. Hello, Rubidia. Rubidia. Okay. Rubidia. Okay, Haro. Tell, Tell me. From one to nine, pronunciation. I don't know. No? No se anima? No. Ok, mencione a alguien para que le ayude. Elizabeth, excelente, gracias. Oh, bye, Elizabeth. <laughs> ok. Eh, smoke salmon. Stuffed turkey. Bread cheese gnocchis. Cheesy, cheesy. Cheese gnocchis. Bread spice. Chicken wings. Grilled veal cutlets. 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 Yes. Fried flounder. Perfect. Mm -hmm. Spice cheese bacon burger. Spice cheese. Cheese sticks. Cheesy, cheesy. Cheesy. Cheese. Sticks. Cheese. Uh, sirloin stick. Sirloin, sirloin, sirloin. Sirloin stick with uh, mushrooms. Sirloin steak. Otra vez, repita. Sirloin steak. Sirloin steak. Sirloin steak with mushrooms. Okay. That's good. Thank you. All right. One more time. Repeat. Smoked salmon. Thank you, Elizabeth. Smoked salmon. Smoked salmon. Top turkey. Top turkey. Bread. 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 Okay, bread it. Bread it. Bread it. Cheese and gnocchi. Cheese and gnocchi. Bread it. Bread it. Bread it. Bread it. Spicy chicken wings. Spicy chicken wings. Spicy chicken wings. Chicken wings. Grill. 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 Cutlass. Grill. Cutlass. Okay, esa U suena como una A. Cutlass. Cutlets. 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 Okay. Next Cutlets. one, number six. Fried flounder. Fried flounder. Flounder. Is that that letter also? Flounder. Ah, flounder. 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 Seven. Spicy cheese and bacon burger. Spicy, Spicy bacon chicken bacon, bacon, bacon burger. 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 Cheese steaks. 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 Cheese Avocado tacos. 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 Sí, tacos. Yes, next one. Eleven. Vamos a ir a tacos. Okay. Para, no, no. para que no haya uh, too much disturbance. So here we go. Number eleven. Uh, Claudita. Repeat. Listen and repeat, Claudita. Okay. Mm -hmm. Spicy nachos. Spicy nachos. Spicy nacho soup. Spicy nacho soup. With cream. With cream. With. With. Ok. Para que suene como una Z, tienes que poner tu lengua en medio de los dientes. With. 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 Ok. With, With cream. cream. Nacho soup. With cream. Spicy nacho soup. With cream. Perfect. All right. Number 12, Alicia. Repeat. Creamy. Creamy. Spicy. 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 Is it spicy or spicy? No. 
Siempre el ceseo. Spicy. Ok. Spicy. Spicy. Perfect. Creamy, spicy tamales. Ok. Creamy, spicy tamales. Perfect. Oh, uh. <laughs> Next one, number 13. Billy, Billy. Billy. Fillet of fish. Billy, Billy, Billy. 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 Fish with a touch with a touch of spicy soy sauce of spicy soy of sauce soy sauce perfect number 14 okay veronica carlita veronica baby crunchy baby crunchy excellent baby crunchy ribs baby crunchy ribs with spicy soy sauce with spicy soy sauce. Perfect. Next one. Rubidia. Hello. Spicy tortilla soup. Spicy tortilla soup. Tortilla. La doble L no existe en inglés. Tortilla en español. Tortilla, tortilla <laughs> in English. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Spicy tortilla soup. Perfect. All right. Noemi. Right. Real ribs. Hello. Real. All right. Hello. Number 16. Repeat. Real ribs. Real, real ribs. With twisted fries. With twisted fries. Perfect. Next one. Number 17. Janet. Janet, Janet. Hello. Oh, hi, hello. Number 17, repeat. Beef soup. Beef soup. Perfect. Thank you. <laughs> so, uh, sorry, Josue. Number 18, repeat. Chicken spicy nuggets. Josue? Josue? Okay, listen and repeat. Chicken spicy nuggets. Chicken and spicy nuggets. Perfect. All right, here we go. Now we're gonna go from one to 18. Lo vamos a hacer con Roxana. Okay, Roxana, como usted entró ya tarde, vamos a hacerlas todas from one to 18 right now. Listen and repeat. <laughs> okay. Hey, Roxy, all the energies right now, the powers. Okay, listen and repeat. Okay. Mock salmon. Smoked salmon. Stuffed turkey. Stuffed turkey. Breaded cheesy gnocchis. Breaded cheesy gnocchis. Breaded spicy chicken wings. Breaded spicy chicken wings. Grilled veal cutlets. Grilled veal cutlets. Fried flounder. Fried flounder. Spicy cheesy bacon burger. Spicy cheesy bacon burger. Cheesy sticks. Cheesy sticks. Sirloin steak with mushrooms. Sirloin steak with mushrooms. Okay. Fried spicy avocado tacos. Fried spicy avocado tacos. Perfect. Spicy nacho soup with cream. Spicy nacho soup with cream. Perfect. Creamy, spicy tamales. Creamy. Creamy, spicy tamales. Perfect. Fillet, fillet fish with a touch spicy soy sauce. Fillet fish. Fillet or fish. Fish with a touch of spicy soy sauce. Excellent. Baby crunchy ribs with spicy soy sauce. 
Baby crunchy. Baby crunchy ribs with the ribs with the spicy, spicy soy sauce. Perfect. Spicy tortilla soup. Spicy tortilla soup. Tortilla. 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 Right. Spicy tortilla soup. Tortilla. Number 16, repeat. Real ribs with twisted fries. Green ribs with twisted fries. Perfect. 17, beef soup. Beef soup. 18, chicken spicy nuggets. Chicken spicy nuggets. Perfect. All right, here we go. Uh, let me see. All right, Noemi. Yes. Okay, de la, from one to nine, díganlas en inglés y díganos qué es. Tell it in English and definition in Spanish. Action. Okay, smoking salmon. Smoked, smoked. Smoked salmon, stuffed turkey, breaded cheesy gnocchis. Okay, but, in the same time, but at the same time, the meaning in Spanish, smoked salmon, salmon ahumado. Stop turkey, all right? Definition in okay. Spanish. The okay, okay. In Spanish. <laughs> Smoked salmon, eh, salmon ahumado, stuffed turkey, como estofado de, de pavo. pavo. Pavo relleno. Ah, pavo relleno. <laughs> Bread of cheese y gnocchis, eh, un pancito, dijo ayer que era. Que hay pasta, es una pasta con queso. Ah, una pasta. Bread and Spice Chicken Wings. Wait, wait, wait. Díganos qué significa. Una pasta con queso. Ah, una pasta con queso y... Y, 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 y pancito. Empanizado. 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 Oh. Ok. Bread and Spice Chicken Wings es este... Alitas de pollo empanizadas picantes. Perfect. Five. <laughs> Grill veal cutlets. Este si no me acuerdo. Chuletas, veal cutlets, chuletas. 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 Asadas. 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 Asadas o a la parrilla. That's good. Delicious. Okay. Yumi, yumi. <laughs> Fry flounder. Ok, la O suena como A. Otra vez. Ah. Fry. Um, flounder. Flounder, la O suena como A. Flounder. Otra vez, one more time. Flounder. Flounder. Right, flounder. All right. <laughs> What is it? No, teacher, no me acuerdo de ese. ¿Quién se acuerda? Who remembers? Uh, Boca eh, colorada. Boca colorada. Es un... Era un pescado. Es... Extinio, Noemi. Okay, Spice, spicy cheese bacon burger. Cheesy, cheesy. Cheesy, spicy cheesy bacon burger. ¿Ah? ¿Una hamburguesa? Una hamburguesa de tocino, tocino sí. carne picante. Con queso y pico. Eso. Con queso, right? Y picante. Y pica, right. pica, pica. Hey, hey, yes, correct. Cheesy stick. Yes. Sticks. Palitos de queso. Deditos. Deditos de queso, palitos de queso. Nine. Sirland stick with mushrooms. Sirland steak. Acuérdate del steak. 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 With mushrooms. Solo me acuerdo que era algo de hongos. De un lobo. Lomo relleno. Sí, este es carne. Lomo sin su lomo. My dear, Billy. Billy. Te toca, Billy. Ay. Bueno, voy, voy, voy a intentar porque. 
porque tengo problemas con lo del video para ver si así mejora. Ok, from 10 to 18. From 10 to 18, de la 10 a la 18. From 10 to 18. Ok. Fried Spacey, avocado, taco. Fry, fry. 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 Eh, son unos tacos antes. Aguacate. Aguacate. Tacos de aguacate o con aguacate picante. Aguacate picante. Son tacos. Spicy nacho soup with cream. Ok. So, es o crema. Una, una sopa de una qué? Una crema de nachos picantes. ¿Una sopa de qué? ¿Una sopa de qué? De, de nachos. Ajá. ¿Picante? Con picante. Con crema. Next one. Es una crema. Con crema. Uh -huh. Uy. Son, con, son como chilaquilas, algo así. Pero son nachos, de los nachos que, que venden la vida, ah. no hay la edad, yes. Ajá, es que así se hacen las chilaquilas con esos nachos. All right, so what you do is this. Uh, you put the, I mean, you have a, pa, a pot, ok, you have a pot, la llenan de agua a hervir y le meten tres bolsas de nachos. Y a esas mm. tres, y a esa, allí dentro que están los nachos sirviendo, le ponen tres chiles. Pero, mm picantes, tres. Entonces, los nachos que son así como blanquitos, terminan red, red. Ok. Rojitos. ¿All right? Y absorben su wow. agua. Absorb all the water. Y ahí lo sirven. You serve it on a plate with cream, con crema. Para sentir menos con picante. Crema. O red. Entonces, lo que hacen es grab the nachos with a spoon, some cream, and bam. Y en la boca es una explosión de sabor. Delicious. Why? Yes. Delicious. Una explosión de picante. Son, oh, no, loca. Oh, pepe. Son tres. Pero los tres tienen distinto sabor. Más los nachos y la crema. My God. All right. Delicious. All right. <risa> ok, Elizabeth. Thank you, Billy. Elizabeth, continúe con okay. number 12. No, 11. No, 11 lo dijo Billy. Sí. Number 12. 12. Cre creamy, spice. Creamy, creamy, creamy. Creamy, no, creamy. Creamy, es creamy. como que si hubiera una U. Uh, creamy. Creamy. No. no. Spicy. Okay, una U. Uh, creamy. Creamy. Excellent. Spice, tamales. 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 Eh, tamales picantes con crema. I like it. Delicious. Continue. Number 13. Pilot or, or fish with a touch of spice soy sauce. Ok. Filete sí, con sí, pescado. No, filete de pescado. Filete de pescado oh, con... Un toque. Con un toque de picante de salsa de soya. Excellent. Soy sauce, salsa soya. Next one, 14. Baby crunch. Crunch. Rice. Crunch. Baby, baby crunchy. Rice. Ribs. With baby ribs. crunchy ribs. Baby ribs. crunchy ribs. With spicy soy sauce. Correct. Okay. Costillas. Son costillas. Costillas ternitas con un toque de, de salsa de soya picante. Yes, correct. 15. Spice, spicy. 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 Tortilla soap. Tortilla. Tortilla, tortilla soap. Uh. Spicy tortilla soup. Perfect. Sopa, Sopa de, de tortilla picante. Good. 16. Grilled 
describes with a twisted phrase. Correct. Three ribs, ¿qué significa? Costillas. Uh, oh, eh, a la parrilla. Costillas a la parrilla. Con, Con... papas. No. Papas, color. Sí, twisted. Papas twisted. Así. Papas twisted, correct. Twisted fries. <coughs> 17. Beef soup. <coughs> Beef soup. Sopa de carne. Sopa de carne. Sopa de res. Sopa de res. Beef soup. Soup. Beef soup. Chicken spicy nuggets. Eh, son ali, como alitas, no. Correcto, Alita, o trocitos uh -huh. eh, de pollo picante. Correcto. ¿Han visto los nuggets, los dulcitos nuggets que vende la Diana? Uh -huh. Ajá. Pues así son los trocitos de los nuggets, de los chicken nuggets, así son. ¿Ah, right? Lo único diferencia es que están rojitos, rojitos, porque son picantes. <risa> But delicious, just really delicious. All right. I Saúl, like sorry, space. My God, yo no sé por qué le digo Saúl a Josué. All right, Josué. <laughs> Josué. Tell me, tell me. All right. From 1 to 18, only you, solo tú, only you. Okay, smoke salmon, stew turkey, red cheese spinach. Gnocchis, gnocchis, gnocchis. Gnocchis? Yes. Okay. Breed spicy chicken wings. Grill bill cutlets. 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 Fried flounder. Fry. Fried flounder. A spicy cheese bacon burger. Burger. Cheese sticks. Cheese sticks. Excellent. Uh, sirloin steak, steak with mushroom. Sirloin steak. Sirloin steak. steak with mushroom. Fried the spicy avocado tacos. Mm -hmm. Spicy nachos soup with cream. Cream, creamy, spicy tamales. Creamy. Creamy. Yes. Okay. <laughs> creamy, spicy tamales. Tamales. Tamales? Yes. You can say tamales or tamales. Tamales, okay. Filet of fish with a touch of a spicy sauce. Baby crunch ribs with the spicy sauce. Crunchy, I remember crunchy. Crunchy, crunchy, okay. crunchy. Spi spicy tortilla soup. 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 La O no se pronuncia, solo la S, la U y la P. Soup. Soup, okay. Grilled with grilled, grilled rib. Grilled. No, grilled. Rib. No, grilled. Grilled, grilled with twist fries. Red. Beef soup. Chicken and spicy nuggets. Perfect. All right, guys. That's the meaning. That's the definition. That's the pronunciation. Okay, what we're gonna do right now, we're gonna go to the rooms and we're gonna practice. I'm gonna put you into the rooms. So I guess you have the picture. Ya tienen la, la foto, right? You have the picture? Yes? yes. Perfect. Yes. yes. Boom. Here we go. Okay. Billy, Billy. Okay. Your camera. Quiero ver su camera. On. Okay. Billy, Billy. That's good. Three, six, nine, twelve, fifteen. That's good. All right, guys. I'm going to put you into the room. And that's what we're going to practice right now. Vamos a hacer la pronunciación primero. Okay. Pronunciation. <laughs> From 1 to 18, de la 1 a la 18, in this moment. So here we go. Okay, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. Good. Create the sessions. Click on the invitation for you to practice las, las expresiones de comida, nada más. Only the food expressions right now. Pronunciation. Boom. Click on the session and practice pronunciation of the food expression. Here we go. All right, Elizabeth, click on the session, go and practice. Okay.
Go, go, go. All right, Adrian, click on the session. Click on the invitation. Excellent. That's good, Adrian. All right, guys, what the students are doing right now, they are practicing pronunciation about food expressions. So let's go and check it out, okay, how they are doing in this moment. Let's join a room in this moment. Action. <laughs> Hola, hola. Hello, hello. Hola. Ahorita voy a compartir la pantalla. Perfect. Escribe, gracias. No, no lo asimilo, no lo asimilo, escribe. Gracias. Es la costumbre. Sí. Como. Okay, guys, don't lose time. Let's start pronouncing the full questions. Action. Filet of fish with a touch of a spicy soap sauce. Perfect. Baby crunchy ribs with a spicy soy soup. Soy soup. Soy soup. So. Spicy tortilla soup. Tortilla, tortilla. <laughs> <laughs> I see tortilla soup. Excellent. Grilled ribs with fish fries. Okay. Beef soup. Chicken and spicy nuggets. Okay, a smoked okay. salmon. Beef soup. Perfect, I like it. Chicken spicy nugget. Excellent. Okay. <clears throat> I commence usted. Oh yo. Smoking salmon. Smoked. Smoked salmon. Perfect. Alice. Sofer turkle. Stuffed. Bread Stuff. cheese. Turkle. Okay. Bread cheese no gnocchis. Excellent. Very space chicken wings. Spicy. Spicy. Spicy, sí, perdón. Siempre que haya una Y ahí, spicy, crunchy, crispy, ¿ok? Siempre tiene que pronunciar esa I, Y. Yes. Ok. Spicy, crunchy, crispy. Spicy, chicken, wheat. Perfect. Grilled beef cutlet. Cutlets. Cutlets. Fried flounder. Excellent. Spicy cheese bacon burger. Perfect. Cheese sticks. Good. Es como esa esa me cuesta, teacher. Silo, sirlo. Sirlo. ¿Cómo? Sirlo. 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 Sirlo steak. Okay, sirlo steak with mushroom. Okay, la u suena como o y las dos o suenan como u. Mushrooms. Mushroom. Perfect. Otra vez, mushrooms. digo todo. Sirlon steak. Sirlon steak with mushroom. Perfect. Okay. <laughs> spicy avocado tacos. Perfect. Chicken is facing the moment. One more time. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> Very good. <laughs> okay, questions about pronunciation. Okay, smoked salmon, stupid right. turkey. Okay, smoked. Es como que hubiera una T explosiva al final. Smoked. 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 Correct. Y el otro también con una T explosiva al final. Stuffed. A stuffed. Correct. Stuffed turkey, bread cheesy, gnocchis, bread yes. spicy, chicken wings. Perfect. Grilled 
Bill Cutlass. No, grilled no, así se escribe, pero la pronunciación es grilled. Grilled. Perfecto. Grilled, Bill Cutlass. Fry. Esa U suena como una A, cutlets. Cutlets. Perfect. Cut. Fry, flounder. Spice, spice, cheesy, bacon burger. Ok, siempre que haya una Y, tienen que pronunciarla como I, spicy. Tienen que pronunciar ese spicy. I. Spicy. 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 Cheesy. Ok. Bacon burger. Cheesy. Cheesy sticks, sirloin stick no. with sirloin, 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 sirloin stick no. with no. Sirloin steak, steak. steak. Correcto. Steak. Acuérdense que esta palabra que dice steak es aquella que viene el beef steak. Acuérdense. Beef steak. steak. Beef okay. Sirloin steak. Sirloin steak with mushrooms. Correct. Fried. Alice. Filet of fish with a touch of spice, spicy so so. Baby crunchy ribs with spicy soy sauce. Spicy tortilla soup. Perfect. Grilled ribs with, with twisted fries. Perfect. Beet soup. Perfect. Chicken baby okay. nugget. Okay. That's correct. Excellent, guys. I like Smoke. it. A smoked salmon. Smoked. A smoke. A, a smoke. Al final es como que existiera una T explosiva, smoked. Repítamelo. Smoked. Smoked. Yes, yeah, smoked salmon. Smoked salmon. Perfect. Stuffed. Smart. Y el otro es stuffed, turkey. Stuffed, turkey. Perfect. Okay. Here we go again, one more time. Thank you, Alicia. <laughs> okay, so guys, so what we're doing right now is asking questions about how much, the use of how much. Okay, I'm gonna share my screen one more time. So if you remember, yesterday I was explaining you, okay, that the one that is in red is for the singular and the one that is in blue is for the plural. Okay, if you see, okay, from one to 18, there are some, uh, some food expressions that they have asterisk. Number three, number four, number eight, number 10, number 12, number 14, number 16, and number 18. So those food expressions, those are in plural. And the ones that don't have asterisk, they are in singular, okay? Okay. All right, so here goes the question. If the food expression is in singular, I'm gonna use how much is. If the food expression is in plural, I'm gonna use how much are. So let's do this. Harold. Hello. Okay. Hello. How much is spicy nacho soup with cream here in El Salvador? <coughs> it's ten dollars. Okay, thank you. Elizabeth, how much are baby crunchy rib with spicy soy sauce here in El Salvador? They are a Five dollars. Thank you. Alicia, how much are fried spicy avocado tacos here in El Salvador? Five 
The microphone, Alicia. Uh -huh. They are five dollars. Perfect. Okay. Right. Doesn't matter the price. No importa el precio. Doesn't matter the price. Lo más importante okay. que estamos practicando en este momento es how much is, how much are. The difference. Okay. And then you say, hey, teacher, how can I, how can I difference the questions? You need to mm -hmm. pay attention. Tienen que poner atención. Si le dicen, how much is, ah, oh, how much is, debo contestar con it's. Si mm -hmm. escuchan, how much are, oh, tengo que contestar, they are. Do you understand? Okay. You need to pay attention. Here we go. Rubilia. Okay. How much are Grillville cutlets here in El Salvador? They are ten dollars. Okay, thank you. Then, Adrian, how much are Silon stay with mushroom? I'm sorry. How much are cheese sticks here in El Salvador? Uh, sorry, I don't listen to you. How much are cheese sticks here in El Salvador? They are fifteen dollars. Okay, thank you, my dear Janet. Janet. No. Okay. How much is spicy nacho soup with cream here in El Salvador? It's eleven dollars. Thank you. Uh, Anita Alvarado. Tell me. Okay. How much is spicy tortilla soup here in El Salvador? It's five dollars. Perfect. All right, that's really good. Vamos a practicar. Noemi, ask the question to Carla Verónica. Noemi, to Carla Verónica, los demás con el micrófono apagado. Action. How much is a uh, stuffed turkey here in El Salvador? It's two dollars. Okay, thank you, Carla. To Roxy. Um, how much are cheese sticks were in El Salvador? They are five dollars. Thank you, Roxy. To Rovidia. Okay. How, how much is a fillet of fish with a touch of spicy sauce here in El Salvador? It's ten dollars. Thank you, Rubidia, to Alicia. Okay, uh, how much are Berele cheese gnocchis? Here is El Salvador. They are $10. Thank you, Alicia, to Billy. Mm. How much is a spicy cheese bacon burger here in El Salvador? $7. Thank you, Billy. To Huddle. How much? Are... Microphone, Billy. Microphone. Microphone. How much are the cylinders that we mushroom head in the Salvador? They are $5. Thank you, Harold. To Jose. How much is a cheese stick here in El Salvador? It is three dollars. Okay, Jose. To Adrian. Okay, how much is a beef soup here in El Salvador? Microphone, Adrian. Microphone. Microphone. It's a uh, five dollars. It's A, ah, no. Ahí no existe la A. Sorry, it's five dollars. Perfect. Adrián, two, Janet. Uh, how much are um, fried spicy avocado tacos here in El Salvador? Uh, they are um, 20 dollars. Perfect. Janet, to Elizabeth. That's good. Uh, how much and beet soup are in El Salvador? 
they are ten dollars. Elizabeth to Omar, excellent. How much is a fried flounder? Here is in El Salvador. It is three dollars. Thank you, Omar. To Anita Alvarado. How much are cheese steeped here in El Salvador? They are ten dollars. Thank you, Anita Alvarado. To Claudita. How much is a pizza soup here in El Salvador? It's a one dollar. No, ahí no existe la. It's one dollar. Okay, yeah. that's good. Why, right, guys? Be careful. Esa muletilla la tenemos pegada porque nosotros tendemos a decir it's a uh, ten dollars. Lo que pasa es que cuando decimos la muletilla en voz alta la decimos después. All right, you understand? Y ahí es donde hay un error. All right. It's ten dollars. Nada de ah. It's five dollars. It's fifteen dollars. That's it. All right. All right, guys. Perfect. I like it. So what we're gonna do right now? I'm gonna put you into the rooms. Just give me some time. Boom. Goodbye. Now into the rooms. I'm gonna put you into the rooms. Vamos a hacer las preguntas. How much? Be careful. How much? How much? How much? How much? No. How much? How much? How much? Okay. How much is? How much are? Okay. Here we go. Time for Excellent. Boom. Yes. All right, guys. Questions using how much? Click on the session. Practice. I mean, me cayó la invitación, teacher. Vamos a ver, Harold, Harold, here, you are here. Now, ahora? No. Not yet? Just give me a second. Two, two, two. Okay, vamos a pasarte entonces. Here, okay. Ahora? Excellent. Y yo, teacher, ¿con quién? Janet, you are with Alicia. No Click on the session. No tengo la mi invitación. Okay, lo voy a hacer otra vez. One, two, three, boom. Okay. Okay, ahí está. There you go, there you go. Perfect. Okay, what the students are doing right now into the rooms, they are asking questions using how much is, how much are. Let's go and check them out. Are five dollars. How much are grilled bell cutlass here in El Salvador? Uh, they are uh, uh, eleven dollars. How much is a fried flounder here in El Salvador? It's five dollars. Uh, Grilled picotles here in El Salvador. It's eleven dollars. Mm, um, no. no, they are. They are. Uh -huh. They are eleven dollars. Okay. How much is a fried flounder here in El Salvador? It's 
Eleven dollar. Perfect. I like it. Dollars. Anita, ¿Mande? cuando digas one, no se dice el plural dollars, porque como solo es uno, solo dices one dollar. Ah. Singular. It's one, one dollar. That's it. Cuando ya lleva ese, es cuando decimos two dollars. Three dollars, pero uno es dollar. That's it. Okay. Yes. How much is a here? How much is a beef soup here in El Salvador? It's a uh, five dollar. It's a. Uh, no. it's five dollar. Right. Excuse me. <laughs> Okay, um, how much are, um, how much are free the spicy big avocado tacos here in El Salvador? How much is a smoked salmon here in El Salvador? It's a, it's $10. Why, right, that's good, continue. Otherwise, so what I was doing was listening to some students, okay, asking questions, how much is, how much are, it was good, pretty good. Hello, Josue, Josue, Josue. All right, how was the practice? Hello. How was the practice? Good, good. All right, pretty good. I can practice. Cool. That's good. Okay, Billy, Rivia are still there, Jan is still there, Adina is still there, Lisa is still there. All right, that's good. All right, guys, excellent, okay? I was telling Anita to be careful when you say one dollar. You don't say one dollars. No, it's incorrect, it's one dollar. Two dollars. Ahí ya lleva la S en two dollars para arriba. But when it's one, it's one dollar, okay? Be careful in that. So here we go. Okay, one more time. Let me share my screen with you right here. Boom, okay. So this is okay while you were practicing right now. Like I promised to you yesterday, this is the next activity. Boom, how many? Okay, how much, okay, significa cuánto cuesta, and how many significa cuántos, okay, cuántos, how many, cuántos, cuántos qué, how many what, all this vocabulary right here, okay, y lo voy a hacer con Anita, Anita, are you ready? Anita? Yes. Okay, Anita. Listen and repeat. Computers. Computers. Chairs. Chairs. Refrigerators. 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 All right, oranges. 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 Excellent. Grapes. Grapes. Custard. Saucers. 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 Red spoons. Spoons. All right, forks. Forks. Knives. 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 Perfect. Funnels. Funnels. Filters. Filters. Hands. Hands. Hats. Pats. Correct. Esta voz suena como A. Pats. Pats. Perfect. All right. Thank you, Anita. 
Now, Omar. Omar, Omar. Thank you, Anita. Omar, Omar. Hola. All right. Listen and repeat. Computers. Computers. Chairs. Chairs. Refrigerators. Refrigerators. Oranges. Oranges. Grapes. Grapes. Saucers. Saucer. Saucers. Saucer. Spoons. Spoon. Forks. Forks. Knives. Nice. Funnels. Funnels. Filters. Filters. Pans. Pans. Pats. Pats. Perfect. All right. Here we go. Computers in Spanish. Hey. Computadora. Computadora. Chairs. Sí, yes. Correct. Refrigerators. Refrigerador. Excellent. Oranges. Naranjas. Excellent. Grapes. Uvas. Uvas. Excellent. Sausers. Salsas. No. No. Pailas. Wow. Las famosas pailas o platillos. Plato oh. pequeño. Right. Yes, correct. Por eso se dice flying saucers. Platillos voladores. Flying saucers. Platillos voladores. Flying saucers. Entonces, saucers, platillos. Más coloquial en nosotros, pailas. Right? Pero pailas ya es náhuatl. Sí. Right. Pailas, <laughs> Next one. Los lutanzas son los guacales. Yeah, correct. Eh, en el oriente son guacales. Yes, sí, correct, sí. correct. <laughs> Next one. Spoons. Cucharas. Cucharas, correct. Forks. Tenedor. Tenedor. Tenedores, correcto. Tenedor. Knives. Cuchillo. Cuchillo. Funnels. Embudos. Excellent. Embudos, correct. Filters. Filtros. No. Filtros. Sí significa filtros, también significa filtros, pero en este caso significa coladores. Ah, ok. Uh, coladores. Filters. Next one. Pants. Tenis. ¿Ah? Sartenes, correct. Sartenes o cacerolas. That's good. Pat. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Excellent. All right. That's the meaning of this vocabulary. Here we go. One more time. Alicia? Hello. Pronunciation, please. So only you. Computers. Chairs. Refrigerator. Refrigerators, yep. <laughs> oranges, grapes, oh. saucers, okay. spoons, oh. spoons, spoons, correct, forks, forks, and knives, knives, yes, funnels, 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 it's a use when come off, funnels, funnels. Mm -hmm. Filters, pants, pole. Suena como... La O suena como una A, pants. Pants. Perfect. All right, that's good. Now, Claudia Xiomara, pronunciation, please. Computers. 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 Chairs. 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 Refrigerators. No, refrigerators. Refrigerators. Orange. Oranges. Oranges. Grapes. Saucer. Saucer, correct. Spoons. Forks. Knives. Correct. Funnels. Filters. Pants. Pads. Perfect. All right, guys. That's the pronunciation, that's the meaning. Example, how many computers do you have in your house? ¿Cuántas computadoras tienes en tu casa? How many chairs do you have in your house? ¿Cuántas sillas tienes en tu casa? Y así sucesivamente. And continue, continue until we finish with that. Responses. Esta es la forma como podemos responder. Okay? A few. Elizabeth. 
Okay. Listen and repeat. A few. A few. A lot. A lot. Only one. Only one. Only two. Only two. Only three. Only three. Only four. Only four. Only five. Only five. Y así podemos continuar mencionando cuántas tenemos. Solo una, solo dos, solo tres, solo cuatro. Okay? And we okay. continue. Next one, Elizabeth, listen and repeat. None. None. There are many. There are many. There are, okay, aquí tenemos un error, okay? Vamos a quitarle ese uno. Let's give me a second, boom. There are many is a plural. Excuse me, yes. Are, okay. Yes. Because ahí tenemos el uno, se fue el uno ahí. Okay, ahora sí, ya lo tenemos bien. Let's give me a second. Boom, here, perfect. Okay, repeat. There are two. There are two. There are three. There are three. There are four. There are four. Okay, ¿por qué quité el uno? Porque el uno solo es, un, solo es singular. No funciona. Just singular. Correct, okay. okay. Next one, repeat. Not many. Not many. Perfect, there are a lot. There are a lot. Perfect. Okay, thank you, Elizabeth. Okay. Janet. Janet, Janet, Janet. Oye, acá estoy, no me escucha. Okay, repeat, a few. A few. A lot. Only one. Only one. Only two. Only two. Only three. Only three. Only four. Only four. Only five. Only five. Correct. None. None. There are many. There are many. There are two. There are two. There are three. There are three. There are four. There are four. Not many. Not many. There are a lot. There are a Será la. Será la. Será la. Será la. Yes, correct. Thank you. Okay, guys. Listen and repeat. Responses. Okay, I'm sorry. Only listen. Solo escuchen. Only listen. Responses. A few. A lot. Only one. Only two. Only three. Only four. Only five. None. There are many. There are two, there are three, there are four. Not many, there are a lot. Ok, practiquemos. ¿A quién vamos a poner? A Claudita. Claudita, me vas a hacer dos preguntas con el computers y chairs. Y yo voy a responder. Ok. How many? How many? How, how, how many? many? Otra vez. How many? Computers. Computers. How, how many computers do you have in your house? Mm, only one. How many chairs do you have in your house? Oh, there are four. There are four. Thank you. Bye bye. Okay. Guys, vamos a ver qué significa esto. A few. Pocas o pocos. Eso significa a few. Pocas o pocos. A lot. Muchos. Muchas. A lot. Only one. Solo una. Only two. Only three. Only four. Only five. None. In Spanish. Ninguna. Ninguna. Nada. O oh, like that. There are many. Muchos. Hay muchas. Hay muchas. Correct. Thank you, Elizabeth. Hay muchas. There are two. Hay oh, dos. Hay dos. Hay there are three. Hay tres. Hay cuatro. There are four. Hay, hay cuatro. cuatro. Correcto. There are. There are significa hay. There are in Spanish means hay. Okay, there are many, hay muchas. There are two, hay dos. There are three, hay, three, hay tres. Okay, and so on. And continue with the number. 
Not many. In no, much. no muchas. No muchas. Not many. All right. Mm -hmm. There are a lot. Mm -hmm. Hay pocas. No. No. Hay muchas. Hay muchas. Hay muchas, hay muchos. Ok, like that. Ahí arriba teníamos el a lot. Uh, muchos, uh -huh, muchos. Que es mucha. Pero ya aquí tenemos más énfasis. There are a lot. Hay, hay muchas. Ok, like that. ¿Y lo sé? All right, here we go. Vamos a practicar. Anita. Anita. Ok, ahora voy contigo. Now I'm going to you. Tú me haces dos preguntas. You have two questions. Refresh the word and answers. Las preguntas le voy a hacer. How many? How many? Refrigerated. Refrigerators, do you have in your house? How many? How, how many orange do you have in your house? There are three. Ya casi me las acabo. There are three. <laughs> okay. okay. Much. Adrián. Okay, okay. Okay. All right. Ask me dos preguntas. Grapes and trousers. How many grapes do you have in your house? None. How many saucers do you have in, the, in your house? A few. Okay. Now, okay. Omar. Omar. Okay. Omar, Omar. Hola. Okay, perfect. Now you ask me the questions. Spoons and forks. How many spoons do you have in your house? There are many. How many for do you have in your house? There are a lot. Okay. Okay. Perfect. Okay, guys, do you understand this? ¿Entienden esto? Do you understand this? Yes. Okay. Yes. Take a picture, porque lo voy a poner en los salones. Take a picture. Yes. All right, here we go. Time for action. ¿Ya le tomaron foto? Yes. Perfect. Okay, guys. Yes. On in this moment. Vamos a pasar lista, okay? With the attendance in this moment. Merci. 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 No. Okay, Adrián. Adrián Cisnado. Present. Perfect. Harold, now in here. Catherine, the self like this. Jose Mario Ramirez. Claudia Xiomara Ordóñez. Claudia Xiomara Ordóñez. Present. All right, that's good. Ana María Alvarado Trejo. Present. Excellent. Thank you. Carla Veronica Arias de Romero. Present. Excellent. All right. Katherine Alexandra Lozano. Katherine Jamilet Vasquez Figueroa. Fredo Omar Salmeron. Present. Excellent. Josué Ernesto Rosales Vasquez. Present. Excellent. Billy Edwin Peña Guillén. Present. All right, that's good. Gloria Noemi Alfaro Cuellar. Present. That's good. Jose Guillermo Paz Serrano. Present. Elizabeth Mendes de Pineda. 
Present teacher. Okay, Alicia Maria Handel Colorado. Present. That's good. Janet Lara. Janet Lara. Janet. 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 Excellent. Excellent. <laughs> Roxana Lisset Cornejo de Gomez. Present. Good. Rosiria y Judith Casillas. Present. Present, teacher. Perfect. All right, that's good. 4, 8, 12, 15. All right, 15. Let me check it out. Yes, 15. Perfect. So guys, let's continue. Remember, you're going to practice questions, asking questions using how many right now in the rooms. Here we go. Just give me recreate this one more time. Okay, it's perfect like this. Excellent. Click on the session to practice how many, how many in the responses. Let's do it right now. Click on the session. Okay, Billy. Anita. Click on the session, Anita. Jose, Jose Paz, click on the session. Janet, okay. click on the session. A mí no me cae la invitación. No le salió. Oh, no la tengo. Okay. I'm going to move you right now. Aparte te quería mandar yo. <laughs> okay. Padre, no, porque no está bien. permiso. There you go, there you go. Okay, Jose Paz. Okay. Join in the meeting. Join in the meeting. In the room. In the practice. Okay. okay. All right. <laughs> All right, guys, so what the students are doing right now is basically asking questions using how many and different responses. So let's go and check it out. How is it going? How's it going there? Estaba malo todavía. There are two, there are three, there are four. Not many. And there are a lot. Okay. 
Tienen que hacer las preguntas. You need to ask the question y uno tiene que responder. Ok. Ok, Billy, you ask the question to Rubidia. Rubidia, you ask the question. You, ask, you answer the questions. Ok. How many computers do you how have many, in your house? How many, many. <laughs> how many? <laughs> how many computers do you have in your house? Only one. How many chairs? How, ah, <laughs> how many chairs do you have in your house? How many chairs? Chairs. How many chairs? Chairs. Correct. How many? How many chairs do you have in your house? Excellent. Okay. There are a lot. Perfect. Okay. How many? How many? How many refrigerators do you have in your house? Only one. Uh, how many orange do you have in your house? No. They are a lot. There are a lot. There are a lot. There are a lot. Mm -hmm. There are a lot. Yes. There are a lot. There are a lot. There are a lot. Be careful in that because you can you tend to say they, but it's not they, it's there. There. Yes. There are a lot. Yes. Okay. How many computers do you have in your house? Perfect. <laughs> Only one. one. How many chairs do you have in your house? Only six. Only five. Only five. Next. It's my turn. Yes. yes. How many orange oranges do you have? Oranges. In plural, remember, we are in plural form. Oranges. How many oranges do you have in your house? Perfect. There are many. Mm. No. 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 <laughs> No, no have. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, here we go. Check it out. Okay. okay. Ask the questions to Roxy. I like to hear this. <laughs> okay, how many computers do you have in your house? Only two. How many chairs do you have in your house? A lot. There are a lot. Mm -hmm. And how many refrigerators do you have in your house? Only one. Refrigerators, refrigerators, refrigerators. Ref <laughs> Refrigerators. Perfect. Now you, Claudia, to Josué. How many orange do you have in your house? No. Okay, be careful with the pronunciation in plural. Oranges. Orange. Orange. Okay. Orange. Oranges. Orange. Okay. Oranges. In the other pronunciation, house is not house, is house. House. Red. 
Hello. 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 Okay, here we go. Noemi, ask the question to Elizabeth, please. No, Elizabeth, you answer the question. Okay. Noemi. The microphone, Noemi, the microphone. Yo le hago la pregunta a Liz. How many computers do you have in your house? Uh, uh, there are three computers. Perfect. Okay. Uh, How many chairs do you have in your house? Only six. Okay. You ask me? Ah, sí. <laughs> How many refrigerator do you have in your house? Only one. How many oranges do you have in your house? None. <laughs> <laughs> Not many. Or none. 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 Okay. How many grapes do you have in your house? Not many. Perfect. I like it. Roxy, Roxy. Hello. Hello, hello. Hello, how's it going? <laughs> How's good? I was listening, okay? Some of you was good. Good, really good. Excellent. Okay. Uh, questions about this? Do you understand this? Entienden esto del how much, how many? Yeah, okay. Yes. Ok. Ya vamos a ver si es cierto. Vamos a preguntarle a Rubivia todo este tiempo. Right? Just mm. check it out. Bye, <laughs> right, Rubivia. Y yo, ¿por qué? Ok, because you were saying yes, 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 yes. Ok, question, Noemi, to Rubivia. How many? How many grapes do you have in your house? Uh, a few. Okay, Rubidia, to Alicia. How many computers yes, computer have? Espérame. Computed, no, how many computers do you have in your house? Excellent. Only three. Okay, Alicia, two, Anita. Mm -hmm. How many apps do you have in your house? Um, a lot. A lot. Okay, that's good. All right, guys, excellent. So I'm going to show you, okay, what you were doing in this moment, just this one, okay? Mm -hmm. Sure. Yes, tell me. Yeah. Tell me. Well, uh, tengo una pregunta. Tell Pero, me. How many eh, eh, indica cantidad y how much también indica cantidad. Yes. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? Ok, remember that you, uh, we were using how much for prices. How much, cuánto cuesta. Ok. Mm. Perfect, good question. I'm going to do this. Just give me a second. Mm -hmm. 
Um, what is the difference to, let me see, boom. I'm gonna go very quickly with this. This one, I'm gonna open up here. So yeah. Copy. Just give me a second, I'm just clicking here very quickly. Okay, here. All right, I'm gonna share my screen with you. Sorry, okay, here, what is it here? Boom, okay guys, I'm ready. So, uh, Adrian, good question. Buena pregunta, good question. Remember that we were using how many, pero Adrian me está diciendo, hey teacher, pero también how much significa cantidad. Excellent, good question. Lo vamos a ver con cantidad. Ahora lo vamos a hacer, let's give me a second, ¿Dónde está el? What is it? I'm sorry, I, for, I lost the pointer in this moment. Let me see what is the pointer. Let me see. Okay, how much means also cantidad. How much sugar do you have in your house? Cuánta azúcar tienes en tu casa? Okay, do you understand? Entienden? Espérenme. How much? Está dando problema este puntero. Okay, aquí estamos. Vamos a ver si ahora sí. Okay, perfect. I'm going to put the, the different options. Sugar, okay, milk. Uh, uh, let me see what else. Um, wine. Uh, let me see another one. Butter. Okay. Esas tres. Esas cuatro. Two, four, five, 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 five. So here, vamos a poner esto. Vamos a ver aquí. In money, teacher. Um, In money. money. How much money? money? For okay. example. Just give me a second. Okay, boom. Okay, perfect. Okay, guys, how much sugar do you have in your house? In the responses, it's going to change. It's going to change. Wow. A little, a lot, yes. Esta no, this one no, none. This one is going to disappear. It's gonna be, there is much, all right? This one is, is going to disappear here. Just give me a second. Okay, this one is going to disappear here. Ya lo entendí. Okay. There is an, okay. There is much. Okay, not much. Okay, and aquí there is. Aquí voy a cambiar is. Okay, perfect. Ahí lo tenemos ya. All right, thank you, Adrián. So basically, this is the way that we explain Adrián's question. Adrián me dijo, okay, teacher, hemos practicado el how much para mm -hmm. precios. ¿Cuánto cuesta? Pero también significa cantidad. Excellent. Aquí está la explicación. Here is the explanation. Y aquí está la pregunta. How much sugar do you have in your house? ¿Cuánta azúcar tienes en tu casa? Y las respuestas van a cambiar. Diferentes del how many. Significa a little. Poco. Poco. Correcto. Porque para el how many decimos a few. Cantidad. ¿Ok? Uh -huh. How much milk do you have in your house? A lot. Mucha. Okay? Mucha. Do, supongamos que tienen dos galones o un galón. Okay? How much meat? Cuánta carne? Okay? How much meat do you have in your house? None. No. Nada. Okay? How much, 
how much wine, vino, vino, how much wine do you have in your house? There is much, hay mucho, okay? Hay mucho, there is significa hay, pero en este caso, para el singular, ¿cuál era el que utilizaban para el plural? Hay. There are, there are, okay? El there is y el there are significan hay. ¿Cuál es la diferencia? What is the difference? There is, is for singular. how much? There it's a singular. Is, and it's singular. There is, is for how much? And there are, is for how many? <coughs> ¿Entienden? ¿Entienden? So, yes. So. Ok, Alicia, no. ¿a dónde nos perdimos? Um, no, después lo voy a repasar. Haga la pregunta, porque así hay, hay otros que quizás están en la misma situación. Sí. Tell us. Yo no termino de comprender tan bien. Así que dale a ¿En qué? Hemos preguntado, Mili. No, primero las damas. Ok. Es que yo Vamos. entiendo que ahí sería diferente, por ejemplo, si ocupáramos. ¿Cuántas botellas de leche sería de raro? Pero, ok, ve. Pero es que aquí ah, es cantidad así, de un producto. Así Ajá. Así aquí es cantidad de un producto. No, aquí Bien. solo es leche. Pero si lo midiéramos, por ejemplo, en botellas, ya sería plural. Correcto. Cuando hablamos de, un, de unidad, sería... Eh, there is. Uh -huh, there is. Cuando hablamos ah, cantidad okay, de okay. volumen. I'm going to explain this, I'm gonna explain this to you. En español, ¿ok? El azúcar, no pueden decir una azúcar, dos azúcar, no pueden ir granito por granito. Está en general aquí. Porque son libras, ¿Cómo? Correcto. ¿Cómo se hace el plural? ¿Cómo se hace el plural? Dos libras de azúcar. Uh -huh. Tres libras de azúcar. Tres kilos de azúcar. Ahí sí está en plural. Pero mientras uh -huh. no lo mencionemos, está en singular. Singular form. Uh -huh. en, 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 en si hablo solo como sugar. General form. Ok. Forma general. En forma singular, eh, perdón. Ok. Another one. Lo voy a poner aquí. Hola. I'm going to put here. Countable. Esto es uncountable. No contable. Uh -huh. Ok. Esto no es contable. La leche, cuando está de forma general, no es contable. Porque no puedes decir una leche, dos leches. ¿Ok? Son tres botellas de leche. Cuatro galones de leche. Ahí sí está en plural. ¿Entiendes? Amén. ¿Ok? Pero mientras no digamos el plural, que serían botellas, galón. Al no decir la unidad de medida. Mientras no se dice la unidad de medida, se mantiene... Se mantiene, se mantiene no contable. Ajá. Ajá. Y utilizamos el how much. Y utilizamos el how much. Y el there is. Vale, ahora, vale. ¿lo entienden así? Yes. Sí. Vale, ahora vamos a ir arriba. Boom. Espérense. Aquí. Vamos a ir aquí arriba. Y le vamos a poner aquí lo que ustedes están ahí que se me... Se me Ahora vamos a poner... 3 kilos de azúcar. Son contables. Vamos a ponerle ahora lo plural que sería aquí. 3 kilos of sugar. ¿Entienden? Yes. Sí. Ahora sí ya está en plural aquí. Pero aquí, mm -hmm. no. Mm -hmm. hey. Do you understand? Yes. Ok, vamos con la leche. Ok, la leche allá no se puede contar. Hagamos que aquí se pueda contar. Two, two. two botellas. Ok, pongámosle botellas. Pues two bottles. bottles. Two bottles of milk. 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 Ahora sí ya lo podemos contar porque son una botella, dos botellas, tres botellas. ¿Do you understand? Yes. yes. Pero aquí no podemos contarla porque está sin... Con, no lo podemos... No podemos 
No podemos ver la leche y meter... Es cuantificable. La no podemos ver la leche y, de, y meter la mano y decir, una leche para ti, una leche para ti, ¿ok? ¿No lo sé? Yo sí puedo decir una sí, leche. Sí. Yo, sí yo sí puedo. Yo sí puedo. Lo si que vienen puedo. en cajita, sí. Yo sí, yo sí puedo, dice. Lo que pasa es que se me va a salir de la mano. A ver, sí. resumiendo, resumiendo, teacher, sería how much para dinero, obviamente, solamente dinero. How much para eh, un producto o una... Algo que no podemos cuantificar. Excel. Y how many, algo, tenemos una cantidad X. Correcto. Por ejemplo, how many, una, dos, tres, cuatro computadoras. Eh, y how much para una generalizado, digamos. Correcto. Correcto. Ok, aquí okay. ponemos ya lo que me estaba, eh, Adrián, ok. Me estaba diciendo money. Ok. How much money, how much money está general. Okay. Right. ¿Cuánto uh -huh. dinero? No estamos hablando, ¿ok? ¿Cuántos dólares? Uh -huh. ¿Ok? ¿Do you understand? No es lo mismo yes. decir dinero a decir dólares. Uh -huh. ¿Do you understand? Yes. ¿Por qué? Porque no puedes decir one money, two money, three money. No puedes estar diciendo un dinero, dos dinero, tres dinero, sino que dices one dollar, two dollars, three dollars, four dollars. ¿Do you understand? Ok. ¿Clear? ¿Poco más claro? Teacher, una pregunta. Yes. Eh, ahorita prácticamente estamos viendo de forma generalizada, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, si me hicieran la pregunta, ¿cuánto azúcar tienes? Y yo respondo, tres libras, por ejemplo, ahí ya sería una respuesta más específica, ¿verdad? Correct. Pero ahorita sería azúcar, tengo mucha, tengo poca, o sea, sería una forma... Generalizada ahorita, ¿verdad? Correct. Pero también puedes, pre, pre, uh, you can answer also, también lo puedes hacer. I have three kilos of sugar. Ok. Not a problem. Ok. Not a problem. For example, yet I can ask you, hey, Omar, how much sugar do you have in your house? Respondeme en plural. Um, I have. I see. I have. Yo tengo. Um, tres libras. Three pounds. Or three three kilos. pounds. Ah, okay. Three kilos. Ah, okay. Ah. Acceptable. Okay. Acceptable. No hay problema. ¿Cómo puedes, cómo puedes decir tengo poco, tengo mucho? O puedes poner a little, a lot, none. Okay. No hay problema. Okay. No problem. Okay. No problem. The thing is, lo que pasa es que primero vamos paso a paso, right? Like this. And with how many, ustedes responden así. With how much, ustedes responden de esta forma. Ok? Y ya después les decimos, ok, guys, no hay problema si ustedes preguntan y lo responden en plural con el how much. Hey, how much milk do you have in your house? Hmm, I have three bottles of milk. No problem, no hay problema. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Yes. It's like in Spanish. Cuando te dicen, mira cuánta leche cuando estás en el supermercado y le llaman al hermano, a la hermana en la casa. Hey, George, how much milk is there in the house? Ok, cuánta leche hay en la casa? Vengo yo y me voy a la refri. Ok, y le digo, si veo que hay botellas, le digo, oh, dos botellas, igual que en español. ¿Do you understand? Mm -hmm. O le puedo decir, poco okay. o poca, a little, ok. ¿Do you understand? Mm -hmm. it's, like, yes. it's like in Spanish, similar to Spanish, only the difference that is in English. Any other question? Otra pregunta? No? No. Excellent. Okay, guys. Do you understand this? ¿Entienden esto? Hello? Yes. 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 
Any, any other question? Otra pregunta? Any other question? No. 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 Ok. Perfect. Estas son las preguntas, ok, que tenemos que hacer siempre, ¿vale? Right? Así como salió Adrián ahí. Hey, teacher, but if it's the quantity, how, how we do it? Good question, Adrián. I like it. That's the way, y esta es la forma, como se hace, ok? Genera, forma generalizada, que no es contable, así se responde. Okay. Y la otra pregunta que me dijo ahorita Omar. Hey, teacher, pero mire... Puedo contestar también en plural. Of course, claro que sí se puede. Good question. All right, like that. Okay, guys, basically that's the way that we use how much, how many. How many, how much. Este how much es para cuando estamos hablando de cantidad, así como me preguntó, okay, uh, Adrián. Este how much es cuando preguntamos por precios. Do you understand? Mm -hmm. Okay, here we go. Don't worry, tomorrow we're going to continue with the review. We're going to yeah. go ahead, okay, with the agenda. Vamos a ver la agenda. Agenda, warm up, reviewing previous class, how, how much. Asking questions using how many. Perfect. Mm -hmm. In this moment, activity number three, asking questions about likes and dislikes. ¿Cómo lo vamos a hacer? How are we going to do it? Like this. Likes and dislikes. Let me put it bigger. Likes and dislikes. Cosas que te gustan y que no te gustan. Likes and dislikes. All right. ¿Cómo lo vamos a practicar? Lo vamos a practicar. We're going to practice in a form of a conversation. All right. Elizabeth, ¿está por ahí? Yes. All right. Yes. Here we go. Elizabeth, how's it going? I can't complain. Oh, do you like ice cream? Elizabeth, yeah. tiene dos opciones de decirme si me gusta, no, no, me, or no. Yes, I do. No, I don't. Yes, I do. I like it. Oh, okay. Do you like onions? Uh, more or less. No. No, I don't. No, no I don't. More or less. Aquí no existe el more or less. O te gusta o no te gusta, ¿ok? No, I don't. Ok. Do you, like, do you like to travel? Yes, I do. Do you like to read comic books? Yes, I do. Do you like green apples? Yes, I do. Do you like to swim in rivers? Yes, I do. Do you like watching terror movies? Okay. Yes, I do. Do you like dancing reggae music? Yes, I do. All right. Thanks for the information. Goodbye. Have a, a good one. Have a good one. Have a good one. Have a good one significa adiós. Okay? okay. Here we go. Roxana. Roxy. Roxana. And Roxana, what happened to Roxana? Let me see. I'm here now. Oh, yes. Roxana, Roxana, can you hear me? Well, no. Anyway, Claudia, are you ready? Okay. Okay, aquí vamos. Hi, how's it going? Okay, complain. Do you like ice cream? Yes, I do. Okay, do you like onions? Cebolla? No, I don't. All right, do you like to travel? Yes, I do. Do you like to read comic books? No, I don't. Do you like green apples? Yes, I do. Do you like to swim in rivers? Yes, I do. Do you like watching terror movies? No, I don't. Do you like dancing reggae music? No, I don't. Okay, <laughs> thanks for the information. Goodbye. Hey, have a good one. Okay, así fluido. Have a good one. Have a good one. Okay, ¿qué es lo que pasa aquí? Este have... Esta V toma a la A y se dice Java. Java cool one. Perfect. Java good one. Good one. Carlita Verónica, ahora contigo. Now with you. Okay. Hi, how's it going? I can't complain. Do you like ice cream? Yes, I do. Do you like onions? 
Wow. Yes, I do. All right. Do you like to travel? Yes, I do. Do you like to read comic books? Yes, I do. Do you like green apples? Yes, I do. Do you like to swim in rivers? No, I don't. Do you like watching terror movies? No, I don't. Do you like dancing reggae music? No, I don't. Okay, thanks for the information. Goodbye. Have a good one. Perfect, that's the pronunciation. Have a, have a good one. Okay, guys, ¿entienden esto? No hay más complemento ahí, ¿verdad, teacher? Solo no. es, yes, I do, no. or no, I don't. No más yes, complemento. Yes, I do, no, I don't. Así lo vamos a practicar ahorita. Yes, I do, sí me gusta, no, I don't, no me gusta. Eso significa. Yes, I do, no, I don't. Yes, I do, no, I don't. Así lo vamos a practicar. Vamos a ver cómo nos va. Billy, are you ready? Ready. Okay, acuérdese. Remember, yes, I do, no, I don't. Here we go. Hey, Billy, do you like magazines? Yes, I do. Do you like cakes? Yes, I do. Do you like soups? Yes, I do. Do you like eggs? Yes, I do. Do you like bagels? Yes, I do. Do you like cheese? Yes, I do. Do you like peanut butter? Crema de, yes, I do. Crema de maní? All right, do you like milk? Yes, I do. Delicious. Esa, esa crema de maní es una adicción total, right? My, sí. that's amazing, all right? Después lo estaba <laughs> en el gym. <laughs> all right. Billy, do you like yogurt? Yes, I do. Do you like butter? Yes, I do. Do you like grapes? Yes, I do. Do you like bread? Yes, I do. Do you like popsicle? Popsicle. Yes, I do. Así se dice paleta en inglés. Popsicle. Popsicle. Yes, popsicle. Okay. Do you like pizza? Yes, I do. Do you like apples? Yes, I do. Do you like corn? Yes, I do. Do you like cookies? Yes, I do. Do you like oranges? Yes, I do. Do you like candy? Yes, I do. Do you like bananas? Yes, I do. Okay, that's good. All right, guys, take a picture. Tómale una foto a esto, porque eso es lo que vamos a hacer. Do you like? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Do you like? Yes, I do. No, I don't. No, I don't. Yes, I do. Do you like? Do you like? Yes, I do. No, I don't. No, I don't. Yes, I do. Do you like? All right, take a picture. Teacher, una pregunta rápida. Yeah. Tell me. Con paleta, proxically. Proxy eh, Popsicle. Eh, Popsicle. Eh, en este caso veo ahí que es paleta como helada, ¿verdad? Sí. Pero también se, también se puede ocupar la palabra como paleta de colores. Ah, oh, esa es como... Uh, tiene otro nombre. Has another name. Ah, uh, let me remember. Popsicle. I forgot the name. Yes, but it has another name. La de colorica es another name. Yeah, I, I spoke... ¿Cómo? Y Ice Pop no, ice no es paleta pop. también. Ice Pop. Uh -huh. um, ok, it's, it's ok, but hay otra expresión que se puede decir, los Frosty Freeze. Frosty, Frosty Freeze. Frosty, Ajá. helado. Helado, yeah. más helado. Frosty Freeze, ok, like that. Frosty Freeze. All right? And Popsicle. Ok. Uh, let me, let me, uh, okay, Omar, that's a good question. I forgot the name of this famous paleta de colores. Las la que son duras, right? No, o sea, paleta de colores me refiero a, a color, color. Por ejemplo, el rojo, el amarillo. Por pintura. Por pintura. Ah, pintura. Pintura. Por pintura. Pero creo que se dice igual. Let me tell, okay, let me check it out right now. Don't worry, okay? Just wait. Uh, let me open up this. Ok, vamos a verificarlo ahorita, don't worry. Let's check it out. That's a good question. Let's check right here. Ok, popsicle, ok. Vamos a ponerlo aquí. Ok, popsicle. Let's see, popsicle. Ok, estamos. Vamos a verlo a ver. Popsicle, vamos a ver si nos aparece de colores, ¿verdad? Right? Si no se dice igual. All right, popsicle. Yeah, popsicle, look. All right. No. Yeah, yes, correct. Popsicle. It's the same. It's the same. Look, popsicle. No. The same, the same. 
Yo creo que él está haciendo la pregunta sobre la paleta de colores para cuando se compra pintura. Sí, así Para es. un carro, para una casa, no por, por los helados. ¡Oh! Paleta para pintar. Sí, paleta de colores. Ok, that's called spatulas or brushes. Ah, ok. Spatula or brushes. Sí, es que me pregunto porque en mi trabajo estoy trabajando con, con eso y vi la palabra popsicle. Ok, popsicle. Ok, remember. También tenemos inglés eh, técnico. ¿Ok? Ajá. Puede ser que el inglés... Por ejemplo, es... tengo... Por ejemplo, tengo neon popsicle. Correcto. Es paleta de neones, o yeah. colores neones. Yes, neon popsicle. Remember, we have technical English. Puede ser que el popsicle que él esté es, utilizando se refiera a eso, ¿ok? Like that. And that is technical English. ¿Ok? Ok, okay gracias. Thank All you. Right. No era problema, ok. No, hombre, Adrián, andábamos perdidos. <laughs> I was looking for, estaba buscando por más paletas. <laughs> paletas sombrillitas. Yeah, con... <laughs> La de ron con pasa. Con yeah. <laughs> pasa. La de chicle. La de pistacho, pistacho, right? <laughs> ok, guys, take a picture. Yeah. ¿Ya le tomaron fotos? <laughs> yes. La otra no. Ok, this one. Take a picture. Okay. Teacher, tengo una pregunta. Tell me. Eh, estaba revisando ahora ya con un poquitito más de tiempo. Yes. Este es diferente al que habíamos tomado en cuanto a lo que es eh, la plataforma. Eh, ingreso, digamos, al, a, la, a la primera, eh, digamos, a la, a la videoconferencia 1, aparece ya activo lo que ya transcurrimos, la 2, la 3, la, la, la 3. La 4 ahorita me lanza, 4, 5, eh, me imagino que 6, 7, me lanza al primer video del primer curso. La pregunta en sí sería, si yo quiero repetir esto, si tengo tiempo para ver toda la clase, eh, ¿a qué horas es que eh, se, se sube eh, la, la videoconferencia que estamos teniendo ahorita? Por ejemplo, porque en el transcurso de las 5 de la tarde, más o menos, recuerdo haber querido eh, ingresar en la plataforma a, la, a, la, a esta, la videoconferencia que tuvimos ayer y, y me salía el video de, del primero que vi en el primer curso. No sé si igual les aparece a los compañeros. Uh, no, remember that you need to have, let me, sh let me show you, okay? Here. I guess I have it right now with me. Okay, here. Esta es la plataforma, okay? Mm -hmm. All right, le va a aparecer así, entonces, en esta, Todavía no lo vemos. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Yes, correct. I'm going to share this. Ok. This is the platform. Can you see it? Hey, ¿Pueden sí. ver? Mm -hmm. Esta es la plataforma, yes. ok. Ahorita estamos viendo simple present negative sentences. Yes, I do. No, I don't. Ok. Ok. All right. Cada cuadrito donde está aquí como película. Mm -hmm. Ahí le va a aparecer el video. Aquí ya está subido, ¿ve? Uh -huh. ¿Ok? Yeah, yeah. El, otro, el otro, el otro, aquí está. Ya está subido acá, ¿ve? Ahí aparecemos todos los guapos. So, right? Beautiful people. Beautiful people. Yes. ¿Ok? Beautiful people. And here, all right, we have the other one. Ah, ahí aparezco. <laughs> 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 right, me agarraron sorprendido. <laughs> all right, that's good. Ok, so here, simple present negative sentences, mañana lo vamos a subir como a las 8 o 10 de la mañana, o right, like that. Ok. Ok, y le voy a poner unas preguntas, ok. Do you like, do you like, do you like, do you like, y ustedes me van a, correr, a responder, yes I do, no I don't. Y también le voy a poner, I'm going to put some questions about how much, how many, pero como Adrián... Nos hizo la pregunta, también le vamos a poner acerca de cantidad también. How much for prices and how much for quantities and how many also. ¿Ok? 
Okay. All right. So, but, yes. I have a question. Yes. Um, Puedo responder, I like. Uh, yes, I like. Only, yes, I do. Yes, yes I, I like. like. Huh? Ok. Yes. Si quieres responder, yes, I like, tendría que ser completa la oración. Yes, I like onions. Mm -hmm. Yes, I like ice cream. Pero no te podrías cortar, ok? La okay. forma corta de responder es, yes, I do. No, I don't. Mm -hmm. Pero es válido, teacher, que, con, que conteste así como dice la compañera. Entonces, yes, I, I like. like. Sí. I like onion. Ok. I, I, yes, I like onion, pero completo. Complete. Por ejemplo, Roxy, do you like popsicles? Yes, I like popsicles. Perfect. Complete form. Ok. In short form, do you like popsicles? Short. Yes, I do. Excellent. Yes, I do. That's it. Any other questions? Good questions. Good question. Me gusta. Eso bueno. Eso bueno. Any other question? Nope. Okay, nope. guys. Perfect. Don't worry. So where are we right now? Right here. Just give me a second. I'm going to put it on the chat, on the main screen. This one. We are right here in this activity. Likes and dislikes, okay? Do you like ice cream? Must this set of pictures, okay? Do you like magazine? Do you like cakes? And so on, so on, until you finish, until banana, all right? So that's basically what we have on the main agenda. Agenda, asking questions about likes and dislikes. Nos va a faltar una actividad. Porque se nos fue el tiempo, pero se nos fue el tiempo en buena forma. Okay? Because Adrián asked us a question about good, all right? And also Omar asked us a question. Teacher, can I answer in the plural form? Use how much? Excellent question. I really like it. And the other question from Roxana Lisek in this moment. Hey, teacher, can I answer this alike? Yes, you can say it, but it's incorrect. You need to say the complete form. Yes, I like onion. Yes, I like popsicle. Yes, I like an apple. All right? But the short form, yes, I do. No, I don't. Okay. So, guys, let me show you. Okay. One more activity. Numero cuatro. Don't worry. No se preocupe. Why? Por qué? Sorry. Okay. Don't worry. No se preocupen. ¿Por qué? Porque ¿cuál era el main objective today? ¿Cuál era el objetivo de la clase ahora? Ask questions about how much and how many as a review. Así que don't worry. No se preocupen. Esto solamente era una introducción. ¿Ok? Que es basically, which is basically this. Mañana vamos a ver esto. Tomorrow we're going to do this. ¿Ok? It's about negative sentences. Check it out here. Negative sentences. Use it. Auxiliaries. What auxiliaries? Simple present. What auxiliaries? Do, don't, does, doesn't. Y vamos a utilizar unos verbos para la tercera persona. She, he, it. Y en la tercera persona, cambia el verbo. ¿Se acuerdan? Ok. Sí. Esto yes. va a ser mañana. ¿Para qué nos va a servir esto? Para crear oraciones negativas. To create negative sentences. Mañana vamos a practicar mucho esto. Y le va a quedar. And it's going to be really clear for you. Ok, guys. Tonight, when we finish the class, Practice this. Coach. Do, you, do you like? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Do you like? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Practice this and practice this. Okay. okay. Coach, okay. I have a question. Okay. Question. Coach. Yes, Josué. Uh, no sé.
cómo va a ser lo de, digamos, lo de las evaluaciones y todo eso, cómo está lo de las notas, la verdad. No sé cómo lo van a hacer o cómo lo hacen ustedes. Quisiera right. saber sobre eso. Eh, Omar, remember, remember that the, uh, here, tienes tareas en la plataforma, tarea 1, tarea 2, tarea 3. Y la de ahora, tarea 4. Ahí están en la plataforma, ¿ok? Ok. Solo, solo serían esas tareas las que nos están evaluando. No, son cuatro ahorita. Acuérdate que son cinco tareas de esta semana. Tienes que hacerla ya para hoy en la noche, a medianoche, tienes que tener terminado eso. Eh, esa era mi misma pregunta, teacher. Y es que en el curso anterior veníamos midiéndonos con eh, ver el video. Eh, con la tarea y con el knowledge check eh, y eso pues nos iba cargando ahí entonces esa era mi pregunta si ver el o sea en la videoconferencia estar en la videoconferencia es la que nos va cargando para la nota y creería que es el caso verdad ok aquí donde ven tarea 4 aquí dice ¿ves? puntaje de 0 puntaje 20 cada vez que lo terminen les va a dar un puntaje lo terminan, solo son cinco preguntas. Y de ahí, enviar. Ok. Ok. Tarea 1, tarea 2, tarea 3, y ahora tarea 4. Solo son de cinco preguntas, no es tanto, ok. Así que no te preocupes, José. Don't worry, José. Lo más ok, que... y otra pregunta. Yes. Y otra pregunta. Es que en una vez yo me equivoqué y lo volví a hacer, la verdad. Eh, y eso, digamos toman la, la primera nota, nada más? No, 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 no. But uh, we check when you redo it again. Nosotros vemos cuando lo haces nuevamente. Okay? ok. Y ahí supongo que por porcentaje. Yes, correct. Ah, ok. All right, so don't worry. Very easy, very simple. All right, guys, practice everything. Practice how much, practice how many. Ahora ya aprendieron vocabulario, ok? Ahora ya no tienen que decir cuchillos en español. Ahora tienen que decir knives. Ahora ya no tienen que decir tenedores en español. Van a decir... Forks. Forks. How do you say, how do you say cuchara en inglés? Spoons. Spoons. ¿Cómo dicen cacerola en inglés? Pants. How do you say olla en inglés? Oh, Alright. How do you say uh, colador in English? Filter. Filter. Oh, wow. Filter. Excellent. Yes. Yo había la palabra colander. 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 Puedes decir colander, puedes decir strainer, y puedes decir filter. Three forms. Not a problem. Colander. Not a problem. Okay. okay, guys. Time's up. I see you tomorrow for more action in English. Today, you learn how to use how much, how many, how much for two different objectives, for quantity and for prices, and how many only for quantities, okay? I see you tomorrow, the same teacher, the same students at the same time. Goodbye, Thank you. have a good night, and sleep like babies, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay. Good night. Have a good night. Bye. 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 Good night. Have a good night.